The leadership of the National Assembly rose in unison on uh, Wednesday with the conclusion that the Nigerian nation was at a uh, crossroads and under serious threat from the current security challenges across the country. Speaking at a three-day national security summit organized by the House of Representatives Special Ad Hoc Committee on National Security, the National Assembly presiding officers also agreed that it was a high time Nigerians worked together in one accord, irrespective of ethnic, political or religious affiliations. We are here because we know that our, nation, our national ambitions will not be attained without lasting peace and security. We are here to have honest conversations about who we are, where we are, how we got here, and the hard choices we must make to guarantee a secure future for all our nation's children. We will, over the next few days, consider the contributions of a cross-section of Nigerian people and develop therefrom recommendations that take into proper account the social and constitutional, political and economic factors that contribute to insecurity in our country. We will identify specific legislative actions and make practical, practicable recommendations for executive action. The challenges that these international borders pose to our national security and interests are enormous. The instability and conflict in the lectured region alone deserves very close attention. Mr. Speaker, honorable members, our nation has had to grapple with various forms of internal security issues over the past decade in all geopolitical zones. Addressing them effectively to restore safety, peace, and security, therefore, remains the responsibility of all Nigerians. It is very idiotic and stupidity for us to be doing the same thing over and over and over again and expect a different result. We will continue to get the same result. Let's be very truthful and honest to ourselves in this country. We all know the problems. How well are we carrying along these people in that age bracket? Who are representing that age bracket in this all? The answer is no. We are not engaging them at all. But whenever we want to go for political posts, appointments, we go back to them. We know the good, we know the bad, and the ugly in their category. As traditional rulers, they are the most active in our system. Let us tell ourselves the truth. They are hungry and they are angry. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.